How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. Series 6 has started for Horizon 5, which means Series 7, or Update 7, is next. We already know a little bit about Series 7, so that's what we're going to cover in today's video. Everything we know about Series 7 so far, and we're going to try to figure it out as a team. If you do enjoy this video guys please do consider subscribing to the channel we do stuff like this every month let's get into it. Now before we get into series 7 itself there was actually something which was rumoured to happen within update 6. Let me explain. You may remember a couple of weeks ago Playground Games gave us a Torben Tuesday. This is an image which is full of clues as to what's in the update. We obviously tried to figure things out and we got quite a lot right and quite a lot wrong as well. But one of the things on the whiteboard was this part here which said 3-4. Long story short, lots of people guessed that potentially something is happening on the 3rd of the 4th aka the 3rd of April. This was after Series 6's release and well 3rd of April has come and gone and nothing's happened so we can sort of forget about that. A few people were sort of looking forward to the 3rd of April hoping something was going to happen within Horizon 5, no idea what it was going to be, but the 3rd of April's gone and nothing's happened, so let's just focus on what's coming in Series 7. Now as always, if you go to your festival playlist and go to the final tab, there is a coming soon tab, and the coming soon tab always gives you a little sneak peek as to what's coming in the next update, and obviously this is for Series 7. Series 7 releases on the 28th of April, which is a few weeks from now, we all know that, but we can see that the topic name is Cinco de Mayo, that is the general name for this next update. It's going to have four things. It's going to have a world makeover, Cinco de Mayo, new reward cars, we'll get to one of the cars in a minute, events, automotive heritage, and new car horns reward. That was a bit of a random one. The only issue I have is you may remember for series six, this is what it looked like for series six. The issue was it actually ended up changing over time. Playground Games actually changed some of the icons and additions. Fingers crossed Series 7 doesn't change and I don't have to remake another video. But for now, let's just go off what we have here. So Cinco de Mayo, what is that? Cinco de Mayo is an annual celebration, so a celebration that happens once a year on the 5th of May, which commemorates the anniversary of Mexico's victory over the French Empire at the Battle of Puebla. I don't know how to pronounce that. So it's just a yearly celebration thing in Mexico, which makes sense because Horizon 5 is based in Mexico. And obviously it says that we're getting some kind of Cinco de Mayo world makeover. So what can we expect? Well, if we go to Google Images and look at just in general what a Cinco de Mayo celebration Celebration looks like we can see it's very colorful it's very dancey it's very Mexican it's very bright what can we expect for world decorations just lots of I don't know bright decorations we can look at a few Google images and just get the general idea of what to expect when it comes to Horizon 5's world makeover for Cinco de Mayo I'm sure there'll be you know fancy colorful banners we may actually get some new costumes like these people are wearing here you know maybe they'll get added to the game try it out yourself go to Google have a bit of Google around see if you can figure out what will be added in this Cinco de Mayo celebration thing see if we can narrow it down now as for features for update 7 we do actually know a few things in the previous live stream from Playground Games about Series 6, somebody actually asked about when are we getting the S2 class vehicles being added to Horizon Tour, and this was Mike's response. Uh, yeah, so I believe that's in the next update in Series 7. Ooh, okay. uh, I think S2 will be added to Horizon Tour, um, but generally speaking for Horizon Tour, the total number of events will be times by 10, I think. Um, so yeah, I think there were around 30 championships previously, they'll now be over 300, wow. um, which will give you not just S2, but a much greater variety across the different car classes cool. and car types. Probably coming in Series 7, we will now be able to drive and use S2 vehicles in an S2 Horizon Tour race. And you probably saw at the end, he also said that even more variations and events are being added to the Horizon Tour list literally being times by 10. So in Series 7, we could very well be getting that feature. Lots more Horizon Tour events added, along with S2 class racing. Very good to see. New cars. Now, there is one car which is rumoured to be coming in the next update so far, and that is the Pagani Huayra. Let me explain. If you go to the official Forza Horizon TikTok page, you will see that just a couple of days ago, they posted a TikTok of just a bit of a cinematic of the Pagani Huayra. Mm. 
Now, if you don't already know, this standard Pagani Huayra isn't in the game at the moment. We've got the Pagani Huayra BC, but not the standard Pagani Huayra. It's not in the game. It may very well be coming in the next update, Series 7, because, well, Forza have quite obviously posted it on their TikTok. What do you think about it? Let me know. The next one along is events. We're getting an automotive heritage event of some sort. Now we can actually figure out what this could be, and this is why. If you just very simply Google automotive heritage, you'll see that it's just, if you don't know what it means, it just means automotive, which is obviously your vehicle related things, automobiles, but old ones, old school, vintage cars, heritage vehicles. You'll see that all of the images you find on Google will just be really, really old cars. Now, let me see if you remember this. On this channel, we always cover leaked stuff, so stuff that's been found within the Horizon 5 files that's not in the game yet. We always cover stuff like that. And just a few weeks ago, we covered something that was found in the files by the Admeister, or the Admeister. I still don't know how to say his name. He posted the following, saying, Barn find files also found for the 1910 Fiat S76 Beast of Turin and 1967 Hearst Shifters Baja Boot. A barn find texture was added to the Community Gift Events Textures Zip, so chances are one or both of these vehicles will work just like Secret Santa. What does this mean? Well this means from what this guy found in the files, I do need to reiterate once again that anything found in the files is not confirmed. This is just guessing, this is just a rumour that I'm making up, I want to know what you guys think of it. But yeah, a barn find texture was added within the Community Gift Events file and we know that we're getting some kind of automotive heritage event and the two vehicles which were added to the barn find files were the 1910 Fiat a 76 Beast of Turin, which is a very sort of vintage, you know, heritage vehicle. It adds up perfectly. Of course, if the 1910 Fiat S76 does come to the game within this event in the next update, that technically means that Fiat has returned to the game. As we can see, KelpyD, another known leaker, has also made this rumour as well. The Automotive Heritage is an interesting event, considering we've got the Fiat S77 leaked as a community reward or something. Maybe it's another event of some sort. We'll have to wait and see. What kind of event this will be, we don't know. Will it be like a secret Santa, where we have to work together as a community to unlock these vehicles? Or will it be another World Cup style event? No way of knowing. Again, we'll have to wait and see. But that is my best guess and the community's best guess so far as to what the Automotive Heritage event is gonna be. New horns, well, there's not really anything we can go into specifics about the new horns. My best guess is it's related to the Cinco de Mayo event and the celebrations. There's going to be some kind of car horn which is to do with the Cinco de Mayo. Maybe some musical tune or something. Something to do with the celebrations. I'm sure you get what I mean. That's my best guess for the horns anyway. Within the next couple of weeks, we will receive a Torben Tuesday for Series 7. I'm going to cover that as well. And I'm sure we'll get given the odd clue for the next update as well. All of that will be covered on this channel. Let me know in the comment section below, guys, what you think is coming in Series 7. That's it for me, guys. Leave a like if you've enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already for more Horizon 5 content and I'll see you all later.